Hey, hi, this is uh, Jan from the top of uh, the, the mountain at Flam. We've been up the Flam Railway. And, uh, uh, and all you can see in the background is the, the hotel because uh, everything else is covered in cloud. So I thought, well, at least you've got a little bit of background. We came up here for uh, traditional coffee and waffles, which I did not partake of, I have to tell you, being very good. Um, and uh, and the, the scenery on the way up here was absolutely stunning. This morning when I woke up um, oh, and opened the balcony doors, it's the first time since we left that I've actually gone, wow. Um, I mean, the other places have been good, they've been beautiful, but nothing that we haven't seen in other places. It's not anything, you know, that's out of the ordinary. But this woke up and just surrounded by these mountains and, uh, uh, and the waterfalls. It's just been amazing. So we got the train early this morning and um, and here we are at the top uh, and we've got an hour to kind of wander around. Not that there's anywhere really to wander because uh, it, you can't see anything. It's just all in cloud. Uh, but it's, it's absolutely a beautiful place. And it would be great if it was sunny, mom, it's raining. So <laughs> it's, uh, yeah. Alan got getting everything but uh, it, it is raining so um, it's not as cold as I expected which is uh, a blessing but the the rain does make it a little bit dismal but uh, we're going back down on this uh, the same way we came up obviously and so we'll be looking at the scenery hopefully we'll be get, getting better pictures Alan's been filming so maybe we'll post a few of those at some point um, but uh, but yeah, I would have done something on the train where you could see stuff, but there's no Wi-Fi on the train and there's no signal on my phone. So I'm on the hotel Wi-Fi at the moment. So yeah, um, packed out train. I, I have to say, if you're going to do Flom, then you need to book ahead because there are people that have managed to get on, but they had to leave at seven o'clock this morning, which would have meant it was even um, more dismal than it is now or they're having to come on the tr later at 12 o'clock which means they're barely back before the ship sails so uh, and they're lucky uh, I think if it had been different weather they would have uh, struggled to get on but um, uh, it was recommended to us that we book before we came and I'm glad we did it's an experience not to be missed I was told that by several people and I'm so glad I listened because um, it really is uh, an extraordinary journey. The train is a rickety old thing where you have to stop for five minutes so that the one coming down can pass. And we go through, the, the, the journey is incredible. It took 20 years to build this railway and there are 20 tunnels that you go through on the way. So um, there are also some hairpin bends. There's a waterfall, which is just amazing. I wanted to do a, a live from the waterfall, but it, uh, as I said, I couldn't get a signal. We stopped there for a few minutes so we could take some, some film or some um, photographs and so on. So uh, yeah, uh, don't miss it, just book it. it. It is worth it. And I'm not an advocate of booking um, on you know, shipboard uh, expeditions and so on and excursions. I'm all for getting off and doing your own thing. But on certain occasions, especially when I've been warned that uh, you might miss it if you don't get it, I, I thought it was worth it. So, but book ahead, but before you get on board, because it's always a bit cheaper to do it that way. So yeah, um, I'll come back to you later today, uh, once we get back on ship and if there's anything else that of interest to report. So thanks for tuning in, feel free to share, and uh, I'll talk to you again soon. So this is Jan, wrapped up in the wet weather. Just uh, got my hood so that I can keep myself dry. So I'm all um, I'm all prepared for the weather. Got some gloves, and um, yeah, this is just so not me um, being uh, in in winter wear on a cruise. It's it's really just so unusual for me. Um, I, I didn't actually know what to bring because it was uh, I, I'm just not used to this. So yeah, roll on the sun. <laughs> and the warm but uh, nevertheless enjoyable it's something you've got to do at least once so 
Uh, talk to you later. Thanks for joining me. Bye.